We've designed the workspace to let you build interactive prototypes as quickly and easily as possible. The menu bar is organized by task. Next to the usual file and edit menus, you'll find the menu View to customize the workspace. You'll also find the menu Simulate to simulate your prototype in Just in Mind Prototyper, along with the menu Share to publish your prototype online, and Report to generate technical documentation. The menu Help will guide you through the program, helping you to create your first prototype. The toolbar offers quick addition options to change the selected item. The User Interface tab includes all the tools and screens you need to create a prototype. Other tabs next to it feature everything to edit scenarios and add comments straight on your prototype. The Component panel features all the elements that you can add on a screen to design your prototype. Just drag and drop them on the canvas, or simply click first on the element and then on the canvas for the element to appear. The canvas shows one of the screens, or UI, of your prototype, so you can edit it. The screen tree is the list of screens of your prototype. Just click on one of the screens, and it will open in the canvas so you can work on it. The property panel shows all the graphic properties of the selected element in the canvas, such as its color, position, border, or text style. Above the canvas, you can see the name of the screen you're currently working on, or the ones that you previously opened. This can be very handy to switch from screen to screen. When clicking on the simulation button, you enter the simulation mode where you can test your prototype instantly. This feature lets you experience your prototype like a final user without having to export it.